and welcome back to another video and in today's video this is my breakdown of the second episode i know this episode is delayed uh i was i had like so much school stuff but yes and i know i need to do uh episode three reason why i didn't do this one as fast is because it's a really short episode it was not sh it was shorter than the other one but it wasn't as jam-packed as the other one. The episode starts off with Mando and Baby Yoda on their speeder until they are attacked or confronted by these, like, bound... I wouldn't say bounty hunters, but, like, these people who want Baby Yoda. And the actual person who had the knife is the same, like, species who whacked Ray in the head at the um, start of episode 7. You then see that lady eating some of the um, dragon from episode 1. And then we get introduced to a new character with some very strange eggs. And I don't know, like, these eggs are supposed to be her, like, uh, future or something. I don't know, like, the future generation. And we don't really get to see any people like this. So they possibly could be on the verge of extin extinction because of like their species that's why it's so important for this character to move forward so like if she kind of knows it that's what i think but nothing really too important about her character only thing is she has some eggs and she needs to go to a planet mando offers to help because her husband uh, is set to uh, know some Mandalorian, so that's where Mando comes in. We then see Mando in the ship, and then the two X-Wings. Now, we did see one of these X-Wings in episode 6, I believe, with the cameo from Dave Filoni, and this was this was really cool. And then the X-Wings kind of chase him, but before they do, <laughs> Mando says, may, uh, may, the fourth, may the Force be with you. Now, that was like a, you know... Obviously, with the New Republic, that's what they kind of say to uh, everyone. May the Force be with you. And it was pretty funny hearing Mando use it because, you know, he's not too fond of, like, the Republic. He's just trying to make a, like, you know, he's just... I mean, before he was... And now he's trying to make, um, you know, a living, you know. He uh, wants credit. He wants to uh, do a job. He's a bounty hunter in the end of the day. Then the X-Wings chase him, and as they chase him... Uh, his ship gets stuck, okay, and then we get to see Baby Yoda eat the eggs. Now, this was very strange to see at the, see at the start, and Baby Yoda really has an addiction. He ho he swallows it whole, and it was just weird to see Baby Yoda swallow, I think, about five of these eggs. Yeah, it was Then very we strange. see the, uh, like, lizard lady, that's what I'm going to call her, <laughs> uh, like, she is freezing in like this uh, really cold, snowy place. It is not Hoth. It is, I can't remember what planet. And yeah, she's really cold. So she goes into a hot tub-ish where warm uh, water is. And we see Baby Yoda full on eat a spider from an egg. And then all of them seem to hatch. And then we get to see like the king of the spiders in this case. Now this scene actually reminded me a lot from Harry Potter Chamber of Secrets with the uh, spider it felt so much like that and then we actually got to see the x-wings help out mando do they help mando they go and mando is there basically repairing his ship and then we it's not fully repaired but at least they get out of that hole and that's where the episode ends and then it, from this scene from the trailer it's kind of like that but anyway, this is my breakdown of the episode. As you noticed, it's not as jam-packed as the other one. It was like one of those standard uh, episodes. This is where, like, this is the middle. So this is what's happened so far and what's going to happen. It's like a waypoint, I would say, this episode is. So anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Please leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Bye.